Hello and welcome to this video on Off to Office. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate through few examples on how to compare data in two worksheets or within the same worksheet in Excel for matching or unique records. We will start with something very basic first. Say we have here two lists side by side. I have made this column right over here indicating the names of all the students of a classroom. To the adjacent column, we have attendance log downloaded from apps like Microsoft Teams or Zoom. Now I want to find out the names of the students present or absent on some particular day. Now there are umpteen ways of identifying data of matches and differences. In this case, the shortest way to achieve this is by using conditional format, which means Excel will format the selected data set if some late conditions are fulfilled or found to be true. Select it. Go to Home tab. Conditional formatting. Highlight cell rules. Duplicate values. Now here you will find many preset formatting like green, red, yellow and also the option of custom format. I will keep it to red only. and see all the matching records have been highlighted with red color. We can apply a filter here to filter names of present and absent students. Filter by color. So 26 people are present and 8 are absent. Now look at a slightly more testing situation. We have here two lists side by side. First is the main list and the second one is the list from where the data is to be searched in the main list for a match. And I have been asked to highlight the rows containing the matching records. We can achieve it through multiple ways. We can use match, we can use VLOOKUP or even simple A quest to be testing if situation permits. And I am going to do it with a match function. See how. Look a value is A4 and I will fix the column referencing of this look a value just the column reference I mean press F4 and column reference referencing has been logged and I will look up array will be log it match type exact match and enter and see what happens and it returns the position of the matching records in this lookup array but our purpose will not be solved by this we have to convert it into true or false so we will insert is this number is it a number is number yes it's a number so it has returned true, drag it down to the last one. Now what we want to do, what we have to do is copy this formula, select this data on which we are going to apply conditional formatting right now. We will create a new rule. apply formula and we are done. The matching techniques will work smoothly as long as data in both the lists are exactly the same. But the moment there is a deviation in the way any name is entered, we are bound to face difficulty. I mean, if names in one of the list is with prefixes like Mr, Mrs or Doctor or if there is some extraneous spaces at the extremes of a text string, then we are going to face problem. No worries, we just need to tweak our search a bit. Let us see how. This is the master list containing all data of the borrowers of a bank and in another list we just have been given names by someone and we have to tell the status of payment of these borrowers extracting it from the master list. Let us apply VLOOKUP. Yes, 
lookup value is a4 comma and table array is the master data lock it i need to extract the one two three third column my match will be exact we drag it to the last row what we see is it extracts some data but only a few why we suspect some extra spaces at both ends in the text string is there so why not first trim and clean this uh, data so we will wrap the cell a3 with trim clean function and then check I will wrap up with trim clean now trim clean helps me get rid out of all the extraneous spaces at both the ends of the text string and now let us check what happens good few more data extracted still few data remain to be matched and extracted the reason may be the names in the master list starts with prefixes like mr mrs or doctor so what we can do here is we use a wildcard asterisk which stands for any string and concatenate it with the cell a3 in the beginning and as well as in the end let us do it in the beginning it is and now in the end press enter okay good well everything is matched and extracted let us say we want to compare visually the data in two sheets of the same workbook and make necessary correction thereof like we want to compare sheet 4 with sheet 5 it would really be inconvenient if we keep switching the tab from one seat to another seat thankfully excel has a feature new window which creates a carbon copy of the same workbook this is com comparing data 2 and this is comparing data 1 these two both are carbon copies and are exactly alike now what we need to do is view arrange all vertically okay now this is seat 4 this is seat 5 we can visually compare these two data and also make necessary correction thereof if we intend to the most interesting thing of this uh, feature is that change in one of the seat will take place automatically in the other as well as they are the replica we can very conveniently close any of the window we wish sometimes we need to visually compare the data located in the different far area of the same seat in that case we can use split option under the view tab which splits seat into four parts this is one area like from 1 to 10 if there is some data far away like at z a some data below so you can see these four areas belong to the same seat and we can very easily do any kind of comparison we wish to do that's it in this video hope you found it useful do like share and subscribe if you find any difficulty with respect to comparing some data you can post problems in the comment section